What is going on guys and today I'm here with another NBA 2K16 building a better team video and in this one this is the long requested one we are going up against CSB yes you heard it this is like the first time me and CSB have done like I guess a collab video and we are doing building the better team you guys know how it is I'll leave the playlist in the description last two videos went up against Mass and King of the Fourth we are doing the 2016-2017 Philadelphia 76ers. You don't know how this series works. It's where we both do the same rebuild on each other's channels and we both have the same straw poll in our descriptions. You, the viewers, have to go vote in the straw poll to see who wins. It's kind of like a fun aspect to it. So you got to make sure to go check out uh, my video and his video. His link, will, his link to his video will be in the description in uh, down below. So don't forget to go check out his video and um, vote in the straw poll in the link in the description. Who won? We're both going to make some pretty super teams. The 76ers, they got assets on assets on assets. It's going to be fun. So I hope you you guys enjoyed and i'll see you guys in the rebuild so here we go guys we're going to be using the 2016-17 philadelphia 76ers these are the settings we are using to build the better team that is the object of this or the goal of this trying to build the better team you guys can factor if you want to vote if the t uh the uh youtuber won championships or not but it's pretty much who you guys think has the better team so the only thing we're doing is uh i guess i'll turn this on hall of fame but we're turning injury frequency um, to 35 and injuries on still. Because I usually play with injuries off. But we're going injuries on and 35 um, injury uh, frequency for the user. And those are our settings for this. And I got to download the roster. All right, guys. So here's our team. It is going to be Ben Simmons, Jaleel Okafor, Sergio Rodriguez is our third best player. We got New Orleans Noel, Joel Embiid, Jared Bayless, Robert Covington, Gerald Henderson, TJ McConnell, or TJ McConnell, Hollis Thompson, Jeremy Grant, Dario Saric is in here. So let's go. We got to make some trades. And the first one, I definitely want to get one of these uh, big men away. Okay, guys. So we are sending away Joel Embiid, a 2018 first round pick, and Sergio Rodriguez over to the Hornets for Kemba Walker, who's only making $12 million a year, and Cody Zeller. So we get our point guard. Um, now let's see our team, what it's looking like. So we got Kemba. We need a shooting guard. As of now, I'll probably trade away Cody. Actually, no, I got to keep Cody's hour. I'll probably trade Covington or Henderson for a shooting guard. And that might be my last trade of uh, this season. All right, guys. I think we'll be pretty good in 2017. So I'm swapping my 2017 pick over to the Raptors for the Nuggets pick. And usually, this is the worst team with this roster. But I don't know how it's going to be. But I still need a shooting guard. So I'm going to see what I can get on the block for. Do I want to trade Covington or Thompson? Uh, let's try to move Hollis Thompson and like... I. Uh, 2019 king's first round pick for a shooting guard and see what we can get any type of shooting guard is good it's just going to be a backup because nick stauskas isn't really going to be here and i'm going to probably trade him in the offseason no matter what so let's see here what we're going to get offered for shooting guard so mike dunley v come on tony allen and jermichael green i don't want to give up come on someone give me a shooting guard no okay marcus morris that's interesting but patrick Beverly. i don't want to give up coming there we go danny green i'll end up trading him in the offseason anyway and we're getting another first round pick out of this i'll see you guys at the end of season one, and this is our team. We got Kemba, Danny Green, Ben Simmons, Nolan Zoel, and Joel Okafor. So Kevin Durant in Golden State wins MVP as Brandon Ingram wins Rookie of the Year in LA. Brandon Knight, Sixth Man of the Year. DeAndre Jordan, Defensive Player of the Year in Boston. He got traded. And Isaiah Thomas gets most improved. And Steve Kerr, obviously, Coach of the Year. Let's see. Did we get anybody on these NBA teams? And Joel Okafor averages, let's see, 22 and 10. He did get hurt, but he made all NBA second team. That is dope. Uh, we it looks like okay Ben Simmons on rookie first team he averaged 4.8 points I don't know what's up with that but uh, we got to make sure that doesn't happen next year so we actually made the playoffs no but we have the Nuggets and the Lakers pick so let's see what they did and I think we might have the Heat pick as well so the Heat were terrible the Nuggets were not that bad the same with the Lakers but I, I think we have the Heat pick I'm not positive though but we somehow made the playoffs with a 39 and 43 record the East was just crap as usual and Kemba Walker had a really nice year. Like, guys like Jared Bayless and uh, Danny Green are getting traded in the offseason. Nick Stauskas, because we got to clear up the cap space. So, honestly, we're probably going to get swept. 2K loves the Bulls. So, I uh, actually know we win. Oh, my God. We get, we upset the number one seed. Are you kidding me? Let me go to the playoff stats. What the heck? Kemba's going off. Danny Green went off. Now we're taking on the four-seeded Pistons. All right. I wasn't expecting this. Um, yeah, but we're down 2-0. And we're about to... Uh, wow, I'm surprised. Oh, okay. We can still come back. Okay, it's 3-2. No, we get eliminated in 6. All right. So, who's going to win it all? It's probably going to be Cleveland or Golden State. And it is going to be Golden State in 
five, and your finals MVP is going to be Kevin Durant. So I'm simulating here to the NBA Jet, and we're going to see what picks we have, and we're obviously going to trade away any players that are making a lot of money, like Danny Green, Nick Skowskis, Gerald Bayless. So let's see what picks we have. Wow, we did have the Heat pick, and let's go. We get the number one pick in the draft. We also have eight, 14, and 16. All right, guys, I'm going to try to do this trade with the Boston Celtics. We're getting Isaiah Thomas for the eighth overall pick, the 14th, 16th, and Danny Green. And they don't want to do that. Okay, I can always throw in a future pick. Like a future 2019 and a second. Yes, and they agree to that. Let's go. We also get Danny Green off the team, which is nice. And I don't mind having these two players for now. I might trade one of them and maybe the number one overall pick. We could try to work out a blockbuster. But we got to move Gerald Bayless, Henderson, and uh, that's about it. Okay, and here's a beautiful trade from the Clippers. We're trading Gerald Bayless and Gerald Henderson to the Clippers for Bryce Johnson and the 19th overall pick, so I'm fine with that. Now I might trade one of our point guards and the number one overall pick to maybe work out a blockbuster, but we'll see. All right, I'm going to try to throw at the Pacers, the number one overall pick, and Kemba Walker for Paul George. I don't know if they're going to accept this, but we can always try it. And they agree to it. Let's freaking go. We trade Kemba Walker and the number one overall pick for Paul George. There's a superstar on our team. There you go, CSV. We get Paul George. And let's see how much money we have for free agency. We're going to have $55 million. I'm obviously not going to be bringing back Cody Zeller, but I'll definitely bring, be bringing back uh, Javiel Okafor and no one's the well, but we're gonna have money to spend on a big name free agent So here with the 19th pick I'm gonna be signing this guy named James Blackman from Indiana and um, Yeah, so I'm not gonna sign that second round pick but team player options All right, so let's bring back Sarge, Jaren Grant, Covington, Holmes we can bring back Noel and okay, that's perfect Let's do all that and let's see how much money we have Okay, it would be nice to get Blake Griffin or Chris Paul in free agency, but I don't know Okay, let's see how much money we have. Hopefully we have a lot Okay, we're gonna have 37 million. I'm excited. I'm excited. Let's see who's gonna be here. Come on, please be someone intent and say okay This is a stud free agency class. So let's go. The guy I want is mr. Russell Westbrook himself Let's offer him that and then we're gonna offer LeBron and others deals as well Okay, so after simulating the first day we get Russell Westbrook and we're still gonna have 12 million to sign somebody else So LeBron goes to the Mavericks and we have 12 million to spend. Can I get Rudy Gobert? Yes Okay, let's definitely try to get Rudy Gobert. He's a restricted free agent, but we can always try and I think, yeah, McCollum and Giannis are going to be asking more than that. Same with Lowry. All right, so if we can't, let's try to get Michael. I don't know. I really want Gobert. Come on. Okay, come on, Gobert. Please don't match it. Utah, don't match it. Yes, let's go. We get Rudy Gobert on the team. Let's just go right to player progression. This team is already looking insane now. We got Russell Westbrook, Paul George, Isaiah Thomas, Ben Simmons, Jaleel Okafor, Nerlens Dewell, Rudy Gobert. I got to make a couple trades at the start of next year, and I'll see you guys there. Okay, guys, 2K's trade logic is helping us out here. We are going to be sending Rudy Gobert and Isaiah Thomas over to the Cavs for Kyrie Irving in a future Cavs first round pick. So I don't even know what this lineup's going to look like. Like, I definitely would want Kyrie starting. And, like, this would be the starting five. I think it's a pretty stud uh, we starting five. The bench will get there, I hope. But, yeah, I think that's... I'm not going to make any more moves, wait, but we got to put Westbrook, I think, at shooting guard. I actually might have to move Irving. We're going to see. But um, if I don't trade Kyrie Irving, I'll see you guys at the end of season number two. Okay, guys, so we finished season number two, and Kevin Durant wins MVP once again. Dennis Smith, Rookie of the Year for the Celtics. Denzel Valentine, Sixth Man of the Year in Chicago. Defensive Player of the Year once again went to DeAndre Jordan. Clint Capella, Most Improved. And we get Coach of the Year, baby. Russell Westbrook, all NBA first team. Look at those numbers absolute beast um let's see if paul george made it actually uh no but you will okafor did uh are we gonna have anybody else there's westbrook and all defensive first team wow paul george didn't make a defensive team maybe he's been hurt uh there's rudy gobert on all defensive second team in cleveland but yeah that looks like it's about it but we go 70 and 12 almost break the record for the most wins in nba a year uh we were three games off but we'll go to player stats you can see paul george was a beast as well kyrie irving 420 point a game scores and then you had, like, a defensive stud. But I think I'm going to trade Ben Simmons in the offseason. Um, is he under contract? No, it's a team option. So I'm probably going to trade him next year, honestly. Because he hasn't done anything for us. And I'll probably end up moving him. But, yeah. So we're going to take on the Bulls here. And, like, we beat them last year in the first round. And, like, we upset them. We should be able to just destroy them here. So game one, we win. What did we win by? We win by... 27 about so let's just simulate the current round. I don't think they're gonna be a match for us as we sweep them All right taking on the Cavs who we made the trade with do they still have a Braun? Oh, uh, no, they do not so they have Isaiah Thomas, but we should get uh, ooh, how'd they get Isaiah Thomas? Did we trade him to Indiana? I don't know. I thought we traded him to Indiana, but Maybe I'm no 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 we traded him in that Kemba deal with uh, Gobert might be might be we traded Kemba to Indiana So let's simulate the current round and see if we can get past them as we win in five and we're taking on the two-seeded Celtics who have Edris Adebayo, Jay Crowder, okay. 
Nothing special. Honestly, like, they're pretty good, but we can get past them, baby. Let's go with Sweep, and we're taking on the Super Team Warriors. The battle of the Super Teams. KD against Westbrook. Game 1, we win. Game 2, we win. Alright, it's 2-1. Okay, we're up 3-1. Let's go. We win a championship in season number two, and we have one more year to build the best team as possible to go up against CSB. Finals MVP was Russell Westbrook. 26 points, 7 rebounds, 6 assists. Uh, we have nobody retiring, I think, from our team, so let's go. I actually didn't check out the uh, standings because the Spur we had the Spurs and the Clippers pick. All right, so the Spurs are really good, but the Clippers really bad. Oh, my God. Let's go. The Clippers were bad because they lost Chris Paul. Let's freaking go, and they don't have DeAndre Jordan anymore. So we should have a top five pick, it looks like. Um, I'm pretty sure we had the Clippers pick. Yes, we do. And it gave us number five. You know, that's fine. I'll take it. But that's still the number fifth pick for winning the championship. I'll probably, I don't even think I'm going to move anybody. I still got to bring back Paul George. It looks like he's a free agent. Um, yes. And then we got to bring back Okafor and Simmons on the deal. So I think I might make my pick a five or I might try to move up in the draft to take a Sharif O'Neal or a Bull Bull. All right. I want to see if the Bucks will do this. I'm going to give up every first round pick I own and a bunch of seconds and three seconds for their number one pick. Will they accept this? No, they do not. Okay, let's just go to whoever has the second pick, and I think they will. All right, it's the Wizards. Come on, Wizards. Yes, there we go. So we're either going to get Bull Bull or Sharif O'Neal. I'll see you guys in the draft with whoever goes number one. We're just going to take it number two. Okay, kind of hoping Sharif O'Neal falls to us. I think Sharif O'Neal would be a really cool addition to this team. But we're going to see if they take Bull Bull or not. Come on, take Bull Bull. They might even take a center, but I think they will. Uh, they probably... Let's see. Are they going to take Bull Bull or Sharif? Um, okay, they take Bull Bull. Let's go. I actually really want to Sharif O'Neal, and we're going to get him. Uh, so yeah, let's take Sharif O'Neal, and I'll see you guys, I guess, at Team Player Options. Uh, so yeah, I'll see you guys at Team Player Options. The Team Player Options, Paul George th does decline his deal. That's expected. I gotta offer him probably a max deal. Uh, so did Kevin Durant. He declined his $0 player option, but yeah, so I'm gonna have to give all my money to Paul George. Unless I can go after KD, but I doubt I can, but I don't wanna risk it. So, qualifying offers to Noel. Alright, let's just get him. Uh, yeah, we probably wouldn't have enough for KD anyway, so let's give him $25 million a year. He should accept that. I want to bring back Noel, Saric, uh, Jerry and Garrett. We need to get that bench, uh, well-rounded up. So, I hope I can bring all these guys in. So, let's bring Paul George, Noel, Saric, and Jeremy Grant. Can I do all this? Yes, I can. Let's go. I'm pretty sure I can. Um, it's saving. All right, let's go. This was the free agency class. Does Mel want to come to a contender? Damn it, Mellow. That would be so clutch. Imagine Mellow wanted to come here. Oh my god. Wait, does Wade want to come here? No. I would hope I'd get lucky with that, but it's not happening. Uh, so yeah. I'll see you guys at player progression. Here's the team. We got Westbrook, George, Simmons, Okafor, Kyrie Irving's going down. I'll probably trade him. I don't know for who yet. Shreef O'Neal, Nerlens Noel, Dario Sarge, Timothy Wawu. So yeah, that's going to be the team now. I'll see you guys start of season three where I got to make some trades. Guys, okay, so we're going to be trading Jeremy Grant and Kyrie Irving over to the Lakers for D'Angelo Russell and Wu Dang. I'm probably going to move D'Angelo Russell's position to a shooting guard. And I'm going to see if his overall goes up. He is an 86. So let's see if he goes up from an 86 to maybe an 87 or an 88. So let's go. Let's go to vitals. Let's change it to a shooting guard. His secondary will be a point guard. And he goes up, it looks like, to an 88. Let's go. Now I'm going to probably try to move on um, Ben Simmons for a nice power forward but we're gonna see who we can get I'm looking to move two first round picks Wall Dang and Ben Simmons over to the Clippers for Blake Griffin this would be such a good addition all right they want New Orleans the well for TJ Warren fine I will do that I really didn't want to but you know what we're getting Blake Griffin and now we have built like an absolute super team we have Westbrook D'Angelo Russell Paul George Blake Griffin and then Javiel Okafor. Then we got Sharif O'Neal, TJ Warren. I think this will be for me now. I'll maybe make a trade at the deadline. But if not, I'll see you guys there. And this could be the final team. And hopefully, it's a good enough team to beat TSBs. Okay, guys. We are here at the end of the regular season. We actually didn't do as well as last year. We were what three games worse this year but we did get the one seed by 17 games we weren't the best record in the nba it was the warriors but we'll check out our player stats uh sharif o'neal i know got hurt in the middle of the year but we had russell westbrook javiel before sharif o'neal d'angelo russell blake griffin really under uh performed but it's still blake griffin so we should be fine there let's see did anybody go up we have a 95 westbrook a 91 george and 88 russell i don't know if this could be better than csb team we probably made a really dope team i don't know if it'll be better but we're taking on the bucks i think we can just sweep them I don't even need to see who's on that team. Um, now, I think they had Bull Bull, but let's see if we can get past the Knicks in the second round here. And we do just that. Now, let's see if we can get past the Raptors in the third round. And we sweep them. Now, here we go, Warriors. We did beat them 3-1 to one last year. Can we sweep them and go 16-0 in the playoffs? No, they win a game. 
but it is 3-1 and we do go back to back in championships so that is going to be for me as you guys know uh russell westbrook wins uh finals mvp for back-to-back -back years you guys gotta vote to in the straw poll in the link in the description of both our videos make sure you check out his video in the link in the description and you guys gotta vote who had the better team so i had westbrook paul george D'Angelo Russell, Jaleel Okafor, Blake Griffin, Sharif O'Neal, TJ Warren, Timothy, or Timothy Wuawu. I definitely pronounced it wrong once again. Dario Sarge, Bryce Johnson, TJ McConnell, Cameron Berso, and James Blackman. So, yeah, you guys got to vote in that show up in the description. Also, let me know in the comments uh, who we should go up against next. But, yeah, that's going to be it for me. Hope you guys enjoyed. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Love you guys, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.